Welcome back to Electronics. Uh, we're going to follow up the Army Babyface Pro FS review with a round trip latency measurement using the RTL utility. You can find a link to that in the description. And here is how you set it up. It's pretty simple. Basically with any interface, you're going to connect it to your source. In this case, a laptop using USB-C connector, plugging it right into the Babyface Pro. And then the only other thing you need is a single cable. Um, this cable is going to plug into one of the outputs and one of the inputs. It's the round trip latency. So what goes out must go in. In this case, I'm plugging into headphone output three and uh, input four, which I actually switch up for the measurements input three just for parity. The desktop we're going to measure here is an i9-9900K CPU, 16 gigs of DDR4 RAM, and Windows 10 Pro. And let's get right into it. It's uh, pretty simple. We switch right over to be able to watch the correct meters. If you try to measure and you don't have the right thing selected, you'll get an error message. Um, you can see I have analog 1 selected. We switch those over to 3, and then we can start our measurements for real. Now I like to measure a couple times on each usually, but we're just scooting right through here. Uh, the buffer size needs to change uh, between every other sample rate change. So you change sample rates, and in order to get the correct buffer size, you just kind of hit that reset or restart device button, at least in this case with the Babyface Pro. You, so we're just going to measure through each of these at the lowest buffer setting that is a realistic buffer setting as well that's what i use is the lowest buffer size on any of these sample rates so it's not just cherry picking for good results and as we finish up these desktop results here they are you can pause it if you want to read through all of those but we're going to move right on to the laptop the laptop is a Lenovo C940. It has the i7 1065G7 processor and 16 gigs of RAM and Windows 10 Pro as well. This is the most recent version of the RTL utility. I have an older one on my desktop. I'm not sure why this only goes to tenths of a millisecond, but uh, the current version at least defaults to that. So we're just going to pop through each of these just like we did on the desktop and you can see they're virtually identical in their speed so you can expect results pretty similar to these these are uh, nice computers and they're cleaned up but that's it that's all you got to do thanks for coming back to electronics for more information on the babyface pro fs